Hey guys, it is now 1.13 a.m., still the 26th of February, 2013, and number six, from all these, it followeth, that this way is the most pleasant, heartsome, desirable, and comfortable way. The man is safe here, and he may... Sing in the ways of the Lord. Psalm 138.5 May they sing of the ways of the Lord, for the glory of the Lord is great. For wisdom ways are ways of the pleasantness, and are her paths and all her paths are peace. Proverbs 3.17 her ways are pleasant ways, and her, all her paths are peace. He is a way that is food, physic, portals, and all that the poor traveler standeth in need of till he come hence. From all which ere we come to particulars, we shall in general point out those duties which natively result thence by ways of use. 1. Oh, what cause is there here for all of us to fall a wander, wandering? Both that God should ever have conden condescended to have appointed a way how sinners and rebels that had wickedly departed from him and deserved to be cast out of his presence and favor forever, might come back again, and enjoy happiness, felicity, and felicity, and the friendship, and favor of that God, that could have got the glory of his justice, and our destruction, and stood in no need of us, or of anything we could do, as also that he appointed such a way, that Jesus Christ, his only Son, should, to speak so, lie as a bridge betwixt God and sinful rebels, and as a highway, that they might return to the great God upon him. Let all the creation of God wonder at this wonderful condescending love of God, that appointed such a way, and of Christ, that was content to loot so low as to become this way to us, this new and living way, and that for this end he should have taken on flesh and become Emmanuel, God with us, and tabernacled with us, that through this veil of his flesh he might consecrate a way to us. Let angels wonder at this condescendency. Two. Hence, we may see ground of being convicted of those things. One, that naturally we are out of the way to peace and favor with God, and in a way that leadeth to death, and so that our misery and wretchedness, so long as it is so, cannot be expressed. Two, that we can do nothing for ourselves, set all our wits a work, we cannot fall upon a way that brings us home. 3. That it is madness for us to seek out another way and to vex ourselves in vain, to run, to run to this and to that mean or invention of our own, and to be, and be found fools in the end. 4. That our madness is so much greater in this, that we will turn to our own ways that will fail us when there is such a noble and excellent and every way satisfying way prepared to our hand. 5. That our wickedness is so desperate that the way which is pointed out to us doth not please us, that we will not enter into it nor walk in it. 6. That this way, which is also the truth and the light, is only worth the embracing is, and is only safe and sure. We should be convinced 
and persuaded of the worth, sufficiency, and desirableness of this way. Reason with ordinary light from the word may teach these things, but grace can only carry them into the heart and make them take rooting there. Three, we may read here our obligations to those particulars. One, to turn our back upon all other false and deceitful ways and not rest there. Two, to enter into this way through the great the gate be narrow and straight, Matthew 7:13. Enter through the narrow gate, for wide is the gate, and broad is the road that leads to destruction, and many enter through it. Luke 13:24. Strive to enter through the narrow door, for many, I tell you, will seek to enter and will not be able. Yet to strive to enter in. Three, to resolve to abide in the way as a quenching in it, resting satisfied with it, and thus to be rooted in him. Collisions 2 7, rooted and built up in him, and established in the faith, just as you were taught, abounding in thanksgiving. and to dwell in him. 1 John 3.24 Whoever keeps his commandments abides in God, and God in him. And by this we know that he abides in us by the Spirit whom he has given us. And to live in him through him. 1 John 4.9 this is how God showed his love among us. He sent his one and only Son into the world that we might live through him. To walk in this way, Colossians 2 6. So then, just as you receive Christ Jesus as Lord, continue to live in him. That is, to make constant use of him, and to make progress in the, in the way, in and through him, to go from strength to strength in him, drawing all our furniture from him by faith, according to the covenant, and that the soul should guard against one, stepping aside out of this good and pleasant way, two, backsliding, three, sitting up and fainting by the way. And a word, this pointeth out our duty to make us, to make use of Christ as our way to the Father, and only of Christ. And this leads us to the particulars, as particulars we shall speak a little too. There are two main things which stand in our way and hinder us from approaching to the Father. One unrighteousness and guilt whereby we are legally banished because of the broken covenant and the righteousness sentence of God according to that covenant and two wickedness impurity and unholiness which is as a physical bar lying in our way because nothing that is unclean can dwell and abide with him who is of pure eyes than he can behold iniquity and nothing that is unclean can enter in there where he is. So then there must be an use making of Christ as a way through both these implements. We need justification and pardon for the one and sanctification and cleansing for the other. Now Christ being the way to the Father boasts as the justification and taken away the enmity and changing our state and removing our unrighteousness and guilt whereby we were lying under the sentence of the law at judging such sinners as we are to hell and as to sanctification and cleansing us from all our pollution renewing our souls 
washing away our spots and defilements, and he must be made use of in reference to both. In speaking to the first, we shall be the shorter, because through God's great mercy, the gospel's pure way of justification by faith in Christ is richly and abundantly cleared up by many worthy authors of late, both as concerning the the electric the the or the practical part and the theatrical part. There we go. And that ends chapter three how Christ uh, how Christ is the way. All right, my brothers and sisters. I love you guys. Peace be with you. Shalom.